whole country also. So those are just some, and I emphasize some, of the examples. And you'll notice, are any of these personal mind maps the same as the others? No. No, they're not. Tremendously individual. So even though you are using the same laws, thinking laws, your own individuality flowers. And to put emphasis on that, Dalmendra has been, for just the last very few months, teaching a thousand people around India. And he's just going to give you a, a quick <laughs> summary of his experience from your own service. Thank you, Dalmendra. Uh, just one question. I will not. <laughs> <laughs> I have shared it with you all day. I'm a Think, Use and Licensed Instructor. I have recently stood first in a creativity test conducted among 15 Think, Use and Licensed Instructors internationally. I have been conducting mind map seminars for the last one year and have done 43 seminars and trained over a thousand people from companies like Hindustan Unilever, Deutsche Bank, CNBC, and plenty of other Fortune 500 companies. I personally use mind maps very, very exhaustively in my personal life. I use them for planning my day, for planning meetings, for planning s telephone calls, for planning my seminars, the flow of the seminars, the marketing of the seminars, the logistics of the seminars. So in just about every conceivable way. And it's also great thrill to have more than 100 testimonials on my website from various people across various designations, various ages, and various industries telling me how mind maps have helped them boost their memory, their creativity, their concentration, their communication skills, and their overall intelligence. So thank you, Tony, for enhancing my intellectual capital and for assisting me in enhancing the intellectual capital of the entire country. I'm really grateful to you. Thank you. We are. And do take, do take the opportunity at the end of the day to uh, chat to Dalmindra about his experiences, especially those of you who are and have indicated your interest in attending 